Okay, the last thing that I want to talk to you about is extra information um, beyond the lectures that you can use to help you with the um, stats content in this unit. So obviously every week, the most important thing that you do for the stats content is listen to these lectures. You need to do them every week. Every week they're available on iLearn. Um, and they're really your main repository for the content, for information, for all of the things that you need to know about this portion of the unit. And hopefully you find them interesting and hopefully you find them a little bit engaging um, with the interactive elements of the lectures, like little questions that pop up to ask you questions to um, test your knowledge as we're going throughout. And with all of the amazing, amazing memes and stats jokes that are supplementing the actual text on the slides. So these are things that I adore. Um, they are an important, important part of my life. And I love sharing the stats jokes and the stats memes with you guys all throughout the lectures. So you'll find heaps of them um, in your lecture slides as we go throughout the unit. Okay, so beyond the lectures, what else can you use? So obviously there's the textbook, and I talked about the textbook earlier in the, this lecture. The textbook is there to supplement and to extend the lectures because there's only so much content that we can actually cover in our one hour each week. So if there's topics that you don't understand, you don't feel like you quite get your head around, you're not quite sure um, about a certain element of it, then obviously go to the recommended or the associated chapter or chapters of the textbook that correspond to the topic of the week. So that's really important. The other place that you can go when you have questions and the best place to go, the first place to go when you have questions is to post them on the iLearn stats discussion forum. So on our units iLearn site, we have a specific dedicated statistics discussion forum that you can go to to ask questions, to make comments, really to talk about anything to do with the stats portion of this unit. And I will be monitoring that forum all throughout the session. Um, and you can also respond to other students' questions and comments and engage with each other. And we can all just have a very lovely environment to talk about all things statistics. So if you have specific questions, that is the best place to go for those questions, to post those questions. And the reason that that's the best place to go is because there are a lot of you enrolled in this unit. And so if you have a question about something, I can guarantee you that other students will be having the same question. And so if you post your questions on that discussion forum, everybody gets access to the same information and you can talk to each other and I can talk to you and it will all be great. So the stats discussion forum is the first place to go if you have specific questions. The other thing that you can do if you've got questions is to ask me yourself in my consultation hours. So throughout the session, starting from week two, the Monday of week two, I'm going to have two hours a week on a Monday afternoon from three to 5 p.m. dedicated to being available for all of you, for you to ask me questions if you have about the stats content of this unit. So for those of you who are going to be on campus or want to come on campus, you can come visit me in my office, which is located at 4 First Walk, room 511. Or alternatively, you can also visit and ask questions on Zoom. So I'll have Zoom going during that time. Um, the meeting, the waiting room will be enabled, which means that when you join the meeting, um, you'll go into the waiting room and then I will let you in one by one so you can ask me questions. Um, that's the link there to the Zoom meeting as well as the password. It's also available on iLearn um, on the home page under the unit contact information section on the right hand side. Um, so during those two hours on a Monday afternoon from week two, I'll be available either in person or online. You don't need to book in beforehand. You can just come and ask me questions, either come visit me in my office um, or on the Zoom link, the Zoom meeting link available there. So that's an opportunity for you. If you've got questions, you can ask me. Um, if you're coming on campus, bring your computer if you want to and we can sit down and look at the data together. Um, if we're doing it over Zoom, you can screen share if you're having any issues to show me um, what you're going through on um, Stata on your computer. So it's a really great way to um, ask me questions, to demonstrate things if you're having problems with things or just to talk in a bit more detail about anything to do with the stats content. So um, please take me up on that. Um, I'm here to answer your questions. It'll be a very lonely two hours if nobody asks me questions. So um, please, please feel free to um, ask me questions that way. The other thing you can do is if that time doesn't suit but you still wanna have a time to chat, is you can send me an email and we can set up at a different time that suits you um, and me as well. And we can have a chat either on the phone or on Zoom or in person. 
So lots of opportunities for you to ask me questions. As I mentioned before, the stats discussion forum is the thing that I'd recommend initially, just because as I mentioned, everybody tends to have similar questions when you're learning content for the first time. And so if you ask a question there, it'll help everybody else. And if other people ask questions, it'll help you if you have a similar question. So the stats discussion forum is usually the first thing that I'd recommend, but I'm also available during those consultation hours or at other times if you want to ask me questions about anything to do with the um, lectures here. They are online lectures, but I am a real person and I am here you know, in real time to answer questions if you have questions. So that's it for our week one lecture. Welcome to week one. You got through all of the lecture, well done. Hopefully you didn't just skip to the end, but you actually have listened to all of it. Uh, and I will talk with you everybody again next week, but bye for now.